Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. You know sometimes when you just play a game you just wish you just never had to change any of your characters because the characters you're playing with are just amazing. Not gonna lie, I do love this Batman, animated Batman Beyond. He's just, it's just something good about him, he's kind of epic. Ouch. Phew, that was close. Okay, so this is not going as I planned, I'm afraid. Come on. I don't think so. Right, so this Deathstroke is just nowhere near as strong as he needs to be because I haven't elited him, so I'm just being really, really lazy, as per usual. Guessing everybody knows how I am, I just don't like to elite characters for some strange reason unless I feel like I need to. Okay, that's you done. Raven, do you move on me? Lovely. Alright, let's just beat you down a bit now. Okay, my life's going down as well, that's cool. Oh, stop doing that, woman. Thank you. Uh oh. Ouch. Love it. Love Arkham Origin Batman with a passion. Right, so I know, I know that's a bit long winded, but hey, I just like to show some gameplay every now and again. Um, so, yeah, I haven't bought a gear lockup booster pack in a while, and I do need some gears. So, let's just go over to the store and show you what I've got at the moment. If I go into collection and I click on my gears. Um, so you can see I've got quite well a lot of one stars. I've got well I've got all the one stars. I've got all the two stars, and I believe I've got all the three stars. I believe, um, but the ones I've promoted, as you can see, or evolved. Um, you can see I've evolved the two star to the three star. Uh, I can't remember what it was called before, um, but now it's a mark of the Lady Shiva. Um, I've evolved Flash's gear card. I've evolved. Raven's gear card, I've evolved Lobo's gear card, Superman's gear card, Green Lantern's gear card, and the Raul Ghoul's gear card. So I've evolved those gear cards. But the next one I want to potentially maybe focus on will probably be the Batmobile gear card. Um, or maybe even the Magic one. I mean, there's so many. I've, I mean, I can see why so many cat people have a lot of the gears evolved to the highest because after a while you start to realize that you actually just want to throw different gears on every now and again just to see how they work with other characters so if i just i'm not going to evolve this one right now but if i just click on fuse just so you can see what gears i've got at the moment you can see i've got 187 red shards 156 blues and 103 greens i can easily get purples by shattering some of my Three stars because I've got quite a few. I think I've got about ten or so three star gears that can be uh, shattered, but I don't want to do it yet in case I accidentally buy something that I don't need. So I just kind of use it when I need to. So let's go back to the store. Let's buy this gear, look our boost pack, and see what I get today. Uh, I've got six six five, so this will just bring me down to six six hundred thousand. So it's not a problem. But I do need some gears, literally just to shatter. So I'm not focused on getting anything specific, but again, it can show the users what kind of gears are obtainable in a gear locker booster pack as well. Again, you get free gears um, up to the value of a three star and potentially you can get this super rare Raul Ghoul's gear card as well, which I've managed to get two of, but instead of paying it singly at 25,000, which would come to 75,000 on free gears, you get a 10,000 discount. So it's well worth getting the gear locker booster pack in that. So guys, without further ado, let's see what I get today. And today I get, oh that's the one, Mark of the Tiger. So I get a one star med kit, a two star black ring, and a two star Mark of the Tiger. Guys, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know if there's anything you need a hand or help with. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.